Hello class! This project shows what a concept of home could look like. This is represented in a living room. In my essay, I cited warmth, nationality, and family as part of that home concept. This is represented here in the fireplace in warm lighting for warmth, the flag of Denmark, which is also a nod to Hamlet for nationality, and in the pictures of the walls for family. Sorry, pictures on the walls. There is also a Polaroid and photo album on the table for family, and a cat on the couch, which could really be warmth or family, and the cup on the table is warmth. There are a few personal touches in this. For example, the cat on the couch represents my actual cat. The pictures on the wall are loose depictions of my actual friends and family. Also, the cup on the table is a depiction of my favorite mug. Another detail that I added is that the books on the shelf are, have abbreviated titles of the books I used in my essay, like Ham and W.S. for Hamlet and Shakespeare. I also added flowers in the vase for the copious amounts of flower imagery in the works we've read, like Hamlet or Sappho. I wanted to create this not only because this was a clear thread from my essay for me, but it's also kind of personal to me. I've actually been displaced from my own home for the past month because a storm damaged my house pretty bad to the point that I've had to stay in a hotel while it's being fixed. Because of that, the concept of home, to me, and how much of a foundation it can be for a person, is not unthought of. To create this project, I laid out a one-point perspective grid and used that to create the outline of a room. Then, still using, using that grid, I added in the big items like the couches, the table, the fireplace. Then, I added in details like the pictures of the cat. I then set down a black and white color to each item, more of a tone really, to make sure each item had the desired contrast with the next. I then used that as a reference to get flat colors for each object. Then I added texture into each object as needed, like making the rug appear shaggier. Lastly, I added in lighting from the fireplace. One challenge that I had to over overcome was that I was really struggling with getting the right colors to convey the feeling across. To, o to overcome that, I basically just focused on what color things might be in real life, then tweak tweaked some colors so they fit more. For example, changing the blue couch to a yellow one, and then added a layer of orange with a low opacity and a couple of layers of lighting over the top to tie it together. In all, I think it's hard to nail down one thing that I want my peers and instructor to take away, but it may be this. Build, build a home that you feel you're most comfortable in and cherish every moment in it that you can. Thank you all. Have a lovely day.